So my name is Linda and I'm the team leader of a service called CareLink, which is part of a charity based in Stoke called Saltbox. At CareLink we offer telephone befriending and support to people who are 50 and over, who live in Stoke, who are lonely and isolated for a whole host of reasons. Our volunteers will ring people up every week, have a chat with them, see how they're doing and if there are any particular problems they're having then we will uh, offer them support and help them out. This year we managed to get some extra funding through which we've been organising trips. Uh, we've taken some of our service users out to a variety of places and today we're in Emma Bridgewater. Our service users have come here, they're doing some decorating, they're decorating uh, plates and bowls and uh, a little bit later they'll be having an afternoon tea. Now the purpose of these trips is really to give them a chance to get out and about, but to meet with other people, but to come out with people that they trust, they've got to know CareLink, they trust us and they feel safe coming out with us. So these are people who, who aren't used to going out and about anymore, a lot of them don't really socialise at all, they don't meet with other people and so uh, it's quite a big thing for them but we've found that they really benefited from coming out, meeting other people and having a really lovely day out. Okay, my name's Nikki and I've been a volunteer at CareLink for about 12 months, just coming up to 12 months now. Um, I got involved because my sister started to work for the charity and told me a little bit about, about the befriending service. Uh, it sounded like something that I'd like to do. Um, so I volunteer sort of a day and a half a week um, and I can do all sorts of things from calling the, the clients, um, having a chat with them about their day, what they've been watching on TV or if they're going out anywhere. It's a really, really lovely way of um, getting in touch with somebody older who is feeling a bit lonely or maybe a bit vulnerable and just spending 10 minutes of, of your day having a chat to them, making sure they're okay. Um, because we call the same clients regularly, we get to know them really well. So if they sound like they're not feeling too well or something's not quite right, we can then signpost that to one of the officers We'll then investigate a little bit further and oftentimes that can save them a trip to the doctors or any crisis of, uh, you know, of happening. It's a really lovely service um, and I really look forward to doing it for a few years to come. So Joyce, how long have you yeah. been with CareLink? Uh, about two or three years now. Okay, and well, how do you find it? Great. Okay, Great. so what do, what do you enjoy about it then? The people that I talk to, yeah. uh, some of them are really funny yeah. and have a good chat. And I look forward to them because sometimes I don't see a soul all day. So, you know, it's good to have a chat with someone. And how long have you been with Kelly? Um, about, about three months, I think. It could be four. And how are you finding it so far? Okay. I didn't realise there was that many people that went to CareLink right. till today. Yeah, yeah. Yes. So yeah. you're enjoying meeting new people, are you? Oh, God, I, I'm a people person. Yeah. I don't feel so cut off from everybody. Yeah. That's great, that's great. Yeah. And so you've come to Emma Bridgewater today. How, how are you finding it so far? I love it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm having fun. Yeah, yeah. Are you learning new skills then, are you? Yeah. Well, I used to be a lithographer years ago. Okay. Okay. Where was that? Dalton's. Okay. And so, do you think if you'd not been here today, would you have been talking to anybody else today? Would you have seen anyone else today? Possibly not. Yeah. So, what have you enjoyed about the day so far? Uh, the company, doing something different. Yeah. Yeah. Are you ready for your lunch a bit later? You ready? For I'm food? always ready for food. Brilliant. <laughs> Lovely. So, what difference has it made to you so far being with Ken? Are you going to use that again? Well, I think it's a wonderful thing. I mean, you can tell I am not a shy person, you know. But there are people who, who are shy, and I, I think this would bring them out a bit. Yeah, yeah, brilliant. So would you recommend CareLink to other people then? Well, I would, yes, yes. You feel as if people care about you. At CareLink, we rely on other people giving of their time and money. If you're interested in knowing more about volunteering with us, then you can look on the website and find out more. We're always looking for more volunteers. We also rely on people's donations. We get some central funding, but that's never enough to go around. So if you would like to give towards this service, which makes a real difference to people who are lonely and isolated in Stoke, then again, you can look on our website. We hope that you've enjoyed watching this film and it's given you a taste of what we do. Thank you again for watching.